Hello and welcome to Backlog Buster episode 4. This is Risk of Rain. Uh, my name's Paul. I'm here with Aaron and Jason again. And uh, we're going to guide you through this game that I've only. I purchased it some time ago, but every time I've tried to play it, it's turned up in a tiny little window on my screen. Aaron comes within 3 metres of my PC and it seems to work, so I'm just going to go with it. This could be a level of incompetence you'll get used to. Yes. <laughs> so, uh, so let's see what this is all about. Yeah, uh, let's see. What... So, so have you not played this at all? I haven't this touched this game. New. Okay, so what is going on? So apparently we've got to pick a character. Commando. Apparently Commando is the only... Oh, is, is this mouse only? It might be mouse only. Oh, well, that's going to be interesting. So Why you've got you the controller control in your hand. Then. I know, that's weird though, because I could control the top of the screen. Well, let's click on some of the other characters and see what happens. It might just be you just going to do this Unlocked. Bit. On. Looks oh, like so locked everything's up. locked. Oh, yeah. that's what the red bits are for. So you get to be a commando to start with, though. That sounds, you know, pretty okay anyway. Yeah. Let's hit play. You've, you've, I think you've left it on medium difficulty. Ah, well, you know. That's why I'm so bad, if anybody asks. <laughs> Uh, double tap. There you go, so that, that fires your gun okay. twice. Excellent. This is a... Very minimalistic graph. It's, it's different looking, isn't it? I like that. I like the fact that you just shot that thing, whatever it was. They look like gummy bears. Yes. Do we think they're gummy bears? Um, I'm going to call them gummy bears now for... Oh, forever. They look like mutant okay. snails to me. Wow, well, who knows? Are you going to be able to get up there? Can you jump very high? He's got a double jump or something, hasn't he? No. Oh, no, he's going to fall. Oh, I fell down. Oh, there's a big ass ladder, though, so it is fine. Oh, and I've said ass, so that's going to put us up a rating bracket, isn't it? Yes. Never mind. Teleporty thing? Press X on the Xbox 360 to activate teleporter. Are you ready? Let's do this. There's a timer in the top corner. Yeah, and it says difficulty very easy. Oh, okay. Oh, God. What on earth is it? Stay alive! Oh, it's the Gummy Bears Master. <laughs> the oh, giant God. masquerading the jellyfish. Gummy jellyfish. Jellyfish and gummy bears, you know, when it comes down to it, it just sounds like I think you're about either. dead, Paul. Run away! <laughs> I'm a bit confused to why you activating a teleporter made a big jellyfish turn up and lots more enemies. And, you know, oh, oh I can see its names at the top, I hadn't even realised. <laughs> It's a wandering vagrant. That doesn't sound anything like a hobo. I've lasted 22 <laughs> seconds out of the apparent 90 seconds I need to survive. You've only got 12 HL. Oh, your HP is steadily rising. Yeah, okay. well, yeah it's, it's about something, so we might survive. We're probably getting back to the teleport. We're flipping it. There's some shooting Dead. things, though. So, so that was interesting. Yeah. Uh, you, em I've embraced the void. So, um... Well, you, you I didn't did. unlock anything. I was killed by a... A gummy bear. Because I can't say Lemurian. Gummy bear. Okay. Yeah, but Lemurian sounds about right. Um, but that big thing was the wandering vagrant. So it was apparently a gentle protector. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have shot the things when they first turned up. It could have been. Yeah. <laughs> Should we try again anyway? I'm interested to see. This is my. Yeah, I'm gonna, try, I'm gonna take another go at it. Yeah. And then we'll we'll see how you, you fellas do. But what I'm actually wondering though is this is this a random environment or is it going to be the same thing every time? This definitely but, seems. This is certainly. Seems to be a roguelike, if you know what I mean. Yeah, that's just it's what I've heard about it. So yeah, it is. It's just a random environment. Yeah, cool. Okay, so that improves repairability by by quite a way. Um, okay. You've been playing it eight seconds and you're still alive, and that looks like it. Ooh. Press X to do something off my screen. Excellent. Is it something canon related? Just press X. I can't because I haven't got forty dollars. Okay, oh. so it's like a buy it thing then. Yeah. It's a giant. Ogre y type thing. Oh dear. Maybe it gives you another gun or something. Probably. Oh, damn, we go. I'll take it we're avoiding the but big thing. Why did you just not drop? You, you don't seem to have any fall damage. But don't miss out on this amazing climbing animation look. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say there's a lot I've of not, effort gone into I've that. I've not seen climbing animation since, on that since uh, Donkey Kong Jr. for the NES. <laughs> Probably true. Oh, it's one of those flyy things. Uh, and they look jellyfish. really small this time. Oh, God. Oh, so you do have fall damage only at extreme heights. See? See? Yeah. <laughs> so, you know, that was a that was pretty major height. Although, those jellyfish do not like you. I oh, know, no, they're coming after me. So, you're going to get up to the top. I, I reckon you're going to have to fight them. Yeah. You could just, like, run in the other direction. They're smaller than the other big jellyfish, so I'd let them get up to... 
a level where you can Maybe them. I should kill them to try and get money. Maybe I can... This is what that, I feel like. Oh, well, they're, they're, they're very quick. I'm very not very well. fast. You're, they've got little health bar, though, rather than that wandering vagrant. I think, you, I think you can beat those. Yeah, there you go. And there's coins which you would now run away from. Oh. It's fine, then. It's okay, just, it's like Sonic 3. You just sucked them in. Nice, I like it. You opened this big gob and went... So basically, I've leveled up. Oh. Nice. Okay. And you ran towards a flame. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was a coin or something. I thought that was like an extra ability. So as soon as you level, monsters come out of nowhere. Well, you know, video games. Oh, there's a, there was a box down there you could get for 25. Was that? Yeah. What's this? 17? I'm sorry, it's a statue. Chance for a reward. chance of rewards. I, do, I right, would go yeah. for the... Oh. Will or the Wisp. Chance to detonate an enemy on kill. Oh, that's... Um, could be useful. That's what I heard about this. There's a lot of, like... Bleeping out. I don't do much damage. Got one hell of a life bar, haven't they? Yeah. I can't decide whether I like this yet. I kind of like the minimalistic graphics they've got going on. Yeah, it, it really does. Rem oh, it, that damage the other enemies as well. That is good. Um, it does very much remind me of a Spectrum game. Yeah. Just with a couple more colours on the screen. I think the, the reason for the minimalistic graphics is because they've concentrated more on gameplay than anything else. Oh, yeah. I'm not, it's certainly not a bad thing. I, I've, I've never been one to... I mean, I like it. I like a nice-looking game. But... Uh, can you try that can anything or have you still got that box? Yes, got enough. But there's, there's, there's the box right below you that you could open now because you've got 25 again. Down here? Yeah. The it's at the bottom. Things. Oh, right, right at the bottom. Yeah. Right at the bottom. Right at the bottom. Yeah. Don't not to fall too far. As if I would. Oh, and you've oh. got a new little friend down there now. I'd deal with that if I were you. Uh -oh, oh, my God. He's like a strong one. Oh, he's cross as well. Bugger. It doesn't appear to hurt you to touch them, so you probably could just run through with them if you need to. You purchase the chest. A mushroom or something? Yeah, a bit Mario. Bustling fun. Quickly heal. heal quickly. Good heal. stuff. Ah, cool. So if you stand still, you start to heal quicker. Yeah, there you go. It's not bad at all, actually, is it? For... And the fungus grows, look. Oh, yes. Cool. The little animations. Oh, are they attacking each are other? Are they fighting each other or are they just waiting for me? No, no they're waiting for you. They're, they're waiting for you. Oh, next to that, I'm off. <laughs> you've got it. Oh. You haven't got enough money anymore, have you? I know, but I'm going to go up here and fight this weakling. I'm interested to, to know what the other character classes will be like for this. Yeah. Because, you know, this... Seems fairly, you know, basic anyway, you know, you're the commando, just means you're the soldier type by the looks of things. I can't imagine what else other cats classes could do. It seems like there will be a lot of content in this game. Yeah, I mean, they should, as much as I've just said I don't really care about graphics. Ah, I saved myself. <laughs> you did take a bit of full damage there. I can't help but notice that the enemies seem to be increasing yeah. whenever you leave them alone. I think it's whenever he levels up, more enemies seem to appear. Could be, yes. Ah! Oh, you've got extra skills there. I thought you were Sonic for a second as well. <laughs> you, you went immune somehow. It's by tapping the, the top of the contro controller. Yeah, see, what, what are these icons that are above? Well, you know where you've I got your level like, 3. I think they have like oh extra skills. No, I think I'm dead. Yeah, they're different skills. Full metal jacket. Tactical vibe. And suppressive fire. Interesting. I'm not sure if these are passive skills or... Um, no, or those, that are, those are active skills. All of them are. And you're dying. Don't worry, I'll stay here and work my healing stuff. There's a jellyfish. Oh yep. god. And you don't appear to have the fungus bit working that well anymore. He's gonna stand still for at least two seconds for uh, it to work. Which is not happening, is it? Not being while being chased by a fast jellyfish. You've got to oh kill yeah, it. he doesn't like you, does he? You've gotta kill it. It wasn't that hard before. Yeah, 
Yeah, nice little tactic. Kind of like this, actually. Not bad, is it? So, how much did this cost? I think at the time this cost me like two, three pounds, and it's recently been on sale again on Steam, so it has got a record of, of being repeatedly on sale. Um, I'm kind of, it's very responsive, like. Yeah, I was going to say, you don't seem to be getting frustrated about the actual controls, which, you know. It reminds me a little, this is going to sound like a ridiculous uh, comparison, but it reminds me a little of Super Meat Boy. Graphically, I can kind of understand that. No, just like, I feel like I'm in complete control of like when I jump, where I jump. Uh, no, I see what you mean, man. Well, just, that just means it's a super responsive control. Yeah. Which it needs to be. God, I've got to stop coming down here. It looks hmm. like it would be very difficult without it. Yeah. Yeah, it already looks insanely difficult. Yeah. It isn't easy. Uh, and like I said, I mean, you've got up a level and the enemies are increasing and increasing. Oh, I'm dead. So, that said, I've passed away. So, do you want to try again? So, you haven't unlocked anything yet, which is interesting. So, I wonder what needs to be done to unlock things. Probably buying stuff and surviving for longer. And probably exploring, because you didn't go over the other side. No, it's all. true. I, 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 I was trying to concentrate on getting money. You appear to have spawned into what looks like quicksand. I wondered why everything was moving. You were saying this is really responsive <laughs> and I was like actually this is really 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 slow. What a horrible map for you first to try. I know. So what button is it? What, 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 how do, oh, I should try that. Do you know how to change skills? No. I hadn't figured that out yet. But you know a little bit of fun all the same. What's this? Is a bin? Open container. Well you know it'd be rude not to. More things. Have a look. That's your experience. This is pretty cool. It is very responsive, isn't it? I mean, yeah. Even though I'm in quicksand, I don't feel like I can't do what I want to do. Ah, oh, that's ah. So I just pressed the um the right uh, bumper button. So it's the top ones that are the skills like that. Yeah. It appears to be. So I dived right. Oh, and I don't know what happened then. Holy cow! <laughs> oh, it's like a geyser. Yeah. But you know, it's interesting. Ah, oh, so that makes sense. But I gambled into it by pressing the left one, so that yeah. was uh, that's pretty cool too. So that's that dreaded teleport, which you've got to activate because it says fine. Now you've got to stay alive for ninety seconds. Well, well you know, vibrant. if the levels of enemies uh, continue at this sort. Oh of my god! Noise, what the heck is that? I don't know, but it, I don't like it. Like very a giant much. hamster. <laughs> it is a giant hamster. Giant hamster of doom. My gosh. That looks like another control. Well, oh, touching it doesn't hurt you, so that's good. Yeah. Excellent. On Xbox to open the contra containers. You may as well. You might find something awesome in there. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it, I'm getting a few coins and stuff, I think, at least. So, I'm getting busy. Yeah. Well, my desire is purely to survive at this point, though. Yeah. Oh yes, how did I do that? Sort of rolly sort of thing. How often can you do that? Uh, it does a little countdown. On the bottom, yeah, four, three. You're, you're invulnerable when you use it as well, so they can't hurt you. You can dash straight through their attacks. So, worth doing. I just keep forgetting I can't do it all the time. Fifty. Ooh, Sixty 60. seconds, you've got thirty seconds left. Okay. And roll again. No, I'm getting ready, counting down. There's a lot of angry puppies and such. Yeah. Giant but, you know, well, I wonder what happens if I do stay alive. Yeah, well, that's that's kind of the, the thing now, isn't it? Yeah. I think it wants you to get back to the teleporter so you can use it. I suspect that's probably true. So, let's see whether I can just stay alive. It's Ten, fast. nine, eight. It does seem rather relaxed with how quickly it moves the timer down. Yeah. I might just be being paranoid though. Dash. Eight. Nine. Get back there. So the seconds of um, You gotta kill the enemies. Surely not. <laughs> Apparently so. Oh god. Oh dear. Hell. So it's all academic anyway, but obviously. That's a bit oh my it? god. 
maybe that uh, you can kill that thing. Maybe that ends the level then. It does seem you can probably to get a reward for end, for, fi for, finishing for killing them level. all before. It seems it, uh, I quite like the exploration part of this game, but I must say the idea of um, you, know, you know having to kill everything it, it isn't appealing. No, it, that's a bit of a bit of a down at. Speaking of a downer, you're dead. Well, yeah, absolutely. Aaron, do you want to have a little, uh, sure. little go? I think we potentially need to use the mouse for this bit, which is a bit interesting. So you're in the desolate forest. Don't have any money. So try and find the... So yeah, so I will, I, I'm assuming that this is how it works for every single level, is you basically got to find the teleporter, Yeah. activate it, Kill create enemy. lots and lots of enemies, try and survive them, I and mean, ultimately kill them all anyway. Yeah, that did seem a bit of a... It seems a bit strange, doesn't it? We may be missing something. So you can fall from quite a height. Yeah. And still be completely fine. And the thing with you is you didn't level up as much as I did. No, true. I didn't have a lot of enemies to level up with, though. I no. probably should have hung around and saw if I could uh, level up a little bit. Some of these little guys are... Little beasts, aren't they? Oh, that was cool. So, it's this one. Aha! Yeah, so that's kind of, yeah... We've got some suppressive fire and that sort of thing. It doesn't seem too bad when you've only got a few enemies. It's when things get mental and you get the big thing come after you. Yeah. Careful of that flamey thing. No. That's right, show us up on your first video, it's fine. Absolutely. $45. Yeah. He is doing well, I have to admit. Where's the teleport though? That's the question. Yeah. Probably down here. I'm going to say yes. See, the levels aren't huge either, are they? But again, that's probably quite good. I don't know, maybe some of them can be. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> yes. I suspected it might. So do you heal naturally anyway when you stand still? Uh, yeah. Well, you heal naturally all the time. Yeah. But when you have that power-up that you had, you heal even more when you're standing still. <clears throat> I think that's going to be quite a lot of fun in this game as well. I imagine I had growing fungus. The, 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 uh... Yeah, I mean, I wonder how many power-ups are like. I, mean, I imagine there's going to be quite a few. Or are, you, uh... are you never going to see the growing fungus again? It's hard to judge when you're going to get hurt by the fall damage. Yeah. Because he can take quite a height. I've got to say as well, from? you've not actually suffered that much damage from fall downs anyway. So you kind of suffered like 10 damage, even from a ruddy grey yeah. fall. So I think you'd have to fall an immense distance to even have it become a factor. Well, that one skill can shoot in two directions at once, which is pretty nice. I just noticed. Kill that guy from over here. That way yeah. he, can't, he can't hurt you. Exactly. What the hell is that? It's a big gummy bear. It's a get away from me. So you definitely have to use the skills, which is something that Paul you didn't mm -hmm. do because we no. didn't know about it. I mean, I barely used, but evidently it's pretty important to uh, to any level of survival. So that's suppressive fire. Forty seems pretty good. So that's really nice, then, isn't it? Level up again. Ah, oh. wrong direction. <laughs> you can use them again, though. Nice. Yeah, so there's well. one skill I haven't used yet, I've noticed. It's I wonder if that's just a pass. Look what looks like a fireball. What is it? Double tap. Fire gun twice. Is that just the one you're doing all the time? Do you think that's just... I think that's oh, just yeah, your... Oh yeah, yeah. It's just this. Yeah. So it doesn't have a cooldown, basically. Which makes sense. I do like the way you're using these skills, so you, you use them quick enough and dive out of the way. Oh, it feels like it works. Yeah. I'm used to action RPGs, so... Are you going to open the chest? Yeah. What, what is that? earth is that? It looks like time. The keeper's secret. For Falling to low health stops time. Okay. Wow, that sounds that useful. That better freeze everyone on the screen. That was what, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, that could be very, very useful. 
Almost want to fall to low. Health, I hope the things, the things, sounds like the thing to do in this might be to uh, open all the chests, then find the teleporter, so that you'll. Well, you can do both because it's probably going to want you to go through the teleporter anyway. Yeah. Oh, wrong button. You're doing very well there, level five. Where's your health? Oh, your health's pretty good. You do get quite a lot more health for leveling up as well. Flipping heck. It does look like you've got to be quite tactical, you know. If something can't yeah. up a ledge, then that's the ideal time to be killing it off. Of course, that flamey little trap is going to be annoying. Did you just jump over his fire bursts? Yeah. Disposable, Disposable missile launcher. Okay, so how do I use this now? No idea. I wonder if it's this button. No, nope. that button. Yep. <laughs> oh, fantastic! No, I like that. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. Yes. Oh, that was cool. They do appear to be attacking each other, unless those are your missiles as well. No, those are the missiles. So he's a teleporter. Uh, but are you going to? Uh, I, I, I would go for it. You know, for you're what? I'm now. You should have waited for your missile launch to. Uh... Ah, fuck it. I'll be fine. It probably will be fine. So, it's only a stupid have... jellyfish. There he is. Yeah. Oh, ow, well, that, one <laughs> that one hurt a lot. <laughs> okay. Oh, great. They, they all started respawning now. That's the thing. Enemies do seem to simply come from nowhere. Yeah. But what we are going to get, depending on how well you do, is the opportunity to see this timekeeper secret. God damn it. See, it's quite tricky, isn't it? It is, when you get to this stage, most definitely. Come on, roll. <laughs> God, I haven't got it yet. There we go. Gosh. Is it, see, some of them can climb. I may be wrong as well, but it looks like this wandering vagrant, the big jellyfish chap, has got more health. Yeah. Um, which makes me think that... The higher level you is, get, yeah. ...may not be make, the wisest thing makes to it do. harder. Yeah, it's freeze a, people. A bit of a mixed bag. Permafrost. Chance to freeze enemies on it. That sounds nice. You're doing well. What's this? Don't know. Five alive. Get them. What? No idea. Oh, it's, oh, it's a challenge. Some, some little Back. things escape. Really not the right time to be chasing after <laughs> that those most messed up. Oh, what the? How on earth are you supposed to see what's going on? <laughs> oh, ah, this is your uh, first time. time. Right, get as far away from as part of... Yeah, either run. Un either unload or... Whoa! Yeah, okay, that, this? that freeze time... Give really me house. Very long. <laughs> Head stompers hurt enemy while falling. <laughs> That's not helpful. You've got 17 left. Oh my god. I so think that's just it. way too many of them. You did very, very well. You did there. extremely well. I'm impressed. So, what sucks to suck. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently so. Do you think one more go through each? No, no, we've no, got the... I, I don't know. I think that's probably time to call it. Yeah, it? I suppose. We've, we've had a go. Uh, it's, a, it. it's a fun game. I'll certainly be playing it now. I can actually see what's going on. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think uh, as, a, as a first go, I'm. I, I think, you know, if it's only three or four pounds, yeah. that feels like I can't like remember what its recommend. original price was, but it certainly goes on sale on Steam quite a lot. I could see it, you know, being quite good on like 360 or yeah, Xbox One or PS4, PS3. Yeah, I mean, you, we, we've been using, for everyone's reference there, an Xbox controller anyway. So it works really nicely on there. I, I'd recommend this one. I yeah. Think, uh, it, I, I wonder whether it'd be worth anything more than maybe five pounds, but I think you know. Well, sub the thing, five pounds. the thing is, we've only we've only tried the first level, yeah. and every time we tried it, it was different. Yeah, it's definitely yeah. got replay value. I think I would definitely play this again. I, I'm massively intrigued about how you unlock stuff. We um, we haven't got past one level, so yeah, you could yeah. You're probably unlock stuff at the end of a level. <laughs> Bit of luck. Yeah. I mean, look at all those different character types as well. Yeah, yeah, there's plenty to do. They're bound to be all different stuff. Uh, but yeah, I really enjoyed that game. Um, I'll probably keep playing this after we stop recording. I, I think you probably should. I mean, you can report back next time. Yeah. Even though we'll have forgotten about it by then. Yeah. But uh, that was Back of the Bus there. This has been Risk of Rain. Mine's Paul. 
My name's Jason. And I'm Aaron. Goodbye. Ta-ra. Bye.